Yeah. Now it does have the manual pump on there. Of it with that promo code. Of it with that promo code. Of it with that promo code. The first time I even had an inkling of uh, sexual attraction or, or the idea of an animal as a sex object, uh, 16 years old. Where that my wife was aware that I had reestablished my intimate relationship with, with my mare. How deeply he felt and how much his love was for horses. Michael and Laurie agreed to bring back Michael's mares into their relationship. But the neat thing was, was she came out and watched, and it was another opportunity to bring us all closer. Any other women, I'm going, well, I don't have an issue with that. Because women can make awesome friends. I enjoy speaking and visiting with women. But uh, overall, you stand a pretty woman and a pretty mare, I'll take the mare. Actually, I was very tempted at the point to uh, have sloppy seconds. It, it turned me on. It, it, was, it was so erotic to, to watch this. I want to give all the praises and the honor to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shah by Hashem, Recha HaKwadash, and double honors to the apostles and the top elder men of Great Millstone, the bishops, also you other elders and you Akims in uh, labor and sincerity, and your few sisters. Want to do this real short video? Uh, I was looking at a little bit of um, this video with the guy Willie D. He was the uh, rapper of um, former rapper of the Ghetto Boys with um, Scarface and Bushwick. So he has his own show, Willie D. And um, I just saw a second of it. He said he got his video flagged for um, showing a, a picture of a woman in a bathing suit. You know, a couple of pictures. And they said it was nudity. Now that brings me to, uh, I did a video some years back on this church pastor who, ha who held a twerk contest, right, in the church. And uh, his video remained. I mean, it's probably still there to this day. And when I put it up showing, you know, what we believe it to be wrong, you know, uh, morally, they uh, flagged it. Now, what I want to go in this video on is say that, um, you can type in weird things on the tube, right? I, I couldn't even bring myself to even take the captions of it. It even blur it out, you know, if you know what I mean. They got men on, on YouTube, right, with sexual devices showing how to make the anatomy work. I'm just trying to keep it clean as possible so they won't flag me for what the heck I'm saying. And the, um, the excuse is, it's educational, you know? Well, isn't that left for the so-called school system or the parents, you know, to teach all that stuff? Educational or not, it can be very offensive to the public eye. Now, we'll do a video that has nothing to do with anything like that. I've got flagged for videos for nudity or whatever. But then they got African men in the jungle jumping up and down with their rods swinging. But that's not nudity because it's educational. So then we got to go to what is educational? <laughs> what, what is educational? Um, we can see the Bible is fully educational, you know, has, you know, full of education. But the, the, the scripture says the wisdom of this world is foolish with the most high right so I don't understand it why that you would have those kind of videos up and claim they're educational but yet to the viewers the first thing they ask you when you go to upload a video is it made for children it's the first thing they do is it made for children and we say no so the platform that we're pushing out is not made from children so that should ex exempt any strikes from nudity, from which we don't put up nude, nude stuff, but if we're trying to teach in an educational platform, but that's to exempt us from all these strikes of hate speech and everything else. <clears throat> because it's our platform, which ultimately the tube is their platform. And when I did the research, the tube is uh, set up under a private corporation 
would exempt them from the freedom of speech law. I read that too. Now that's kind of crazy because the the whole platform is still based upon an American justice system. So how is that possible? There's a whole lot of inconsistencies, but this is the confusion of Babel. So now, all you got to do is say, okay, let me get my own private uh, porn section, and then what I can do is I can, I can do all these things, I'm trying to keep it clean, with adolescents and uh, all kinds of crazy things I want to do because why well, I'm on a private platform but this is what you see here there's all kinds of crazy things on YouTube there's a, a, a documentary called Animal Passions you know this uh, this man and we know who this man is he's laying with horses and mules and donkeys and a woman same thing and they're getting excited over it. Z zoophiles or whatever they call them. That's still on the tube. And that's not considered nudity. Right? It's considered because it's educational purposes. I, I don't want any of my children, sons or daughters, if I have any, you know, anybody got daughters, being educated on that. That's not need. There's no need to be educated for that. All they need to be educated is in the scriptures to know that that is wrong. I don't need to show no big pictures, and I don't need to put the 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 man and a woman showing the actions of what they're doing with the pedof with the pedophilia going on. What you're going to do? Show movies on big screens? Put it up there and say it's for educational purposes? So then the, the rabbit hole, the dynamics go far because now you can make up everything and put anything you want in place because it's your platform to make anything educational that we see is wicked. But what we have is righteous, you see is wicked. This is the power of the Most High, man. And right now, yeah, the, pretty much the truth is out, so... Wouldn't be right if I don't get a scripture real quick. Isaiah 55 and um, and 11. So shall my word be that go forth out of my mouth. It shall not return unto me void. But it shall accomplish that which I please. And I shall and it shall prosper. And the, and the thing which I sent it. For ye shall go out with joy and be led forth with peace. The mountains and the hills shall break. Uh, forth before you into singing and all the trees of the field shall clap uh, at their hands right instead of the thorn shall come I'm just reading this instead of the thorn shall come up the, the fir tree and instead of the brier shall come up the myrtle tree right and it shall be to the Lord for a name right that name for an everlasting sign that shall not be cut off. So we're rejoicing. We're going to be rejoicing. Uh, you know, and if there was not such a threat, there would be no reason. If you remember back in the day when we was doing these videos, oh, we were no big threat, no big deal. Now they start passing these laws. Now this is, is a really big deal. But the Lord says, don't worry. It come out of my mouth. It's going to be sent. Uh, what's going to happen? Is going to happen and ultimately we're not to be worried we're not to be super frustrated that they slash in our channels I got several I got many channels but we shouldn't be you know really frustrated I mean we do because we sign cries as equal nine and four say but ultimately this is this has to happen this is how the kingdom gonna be brought in the Lord doesn't destroy anything that's not wicked <laughs> so Hey, it's 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 out of the bag now. So hey, this is what it is. I just want to touch on this short video. You know, that's all I have on that. Shalom.